Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a pie chart. We're going to create a pie chart where we're going to compare the Region 2 sales contributions in January. And the purpose of a pie chart is to show the relationship of one component to the whole or parts of the whole. <clears throat> okay, so I want to know about Region 2. So I'm going to select Region 2. And I want to know about um, the highest sales in January. So my range, my sale range for this chart is um, B9 to C13. I'm going to click on insert. And over here you see this thing looks like a pie. I'm going to click on that. You can do a 2D pie, 3D pie, it's up to you, but we'll do something kind of cool and just stick with the 3D pie. Okay, now if you look at it, how in the world are you supposed to decipher it? So let's clean it up a bit. We're going to click on this plus sign. From the plus sign, we're going to click on data labels. Well, that helps. Now we're going to click on this right arrow. And we're going to click on more options. I do not want the value. I want the percentage. So I click percentage and I click the value to take that away. Well, I also want to know who it is. So I don't have to look down here and go, um, this purple one. Well, is the purple this one, this one, this one, or that one? I don't know. So we're going to include the category name. Well, that really helps clear it up a bit. Okay, so if you see here, this is this gray thing right here. This is called a leader line. So let's select all that again. So we can choose to have leader lines shown or not shown. So we can choose to not show them or to show them. We're going to choose not. And we're going to choose to put the um, stuff on the inside. There we go. How awesome is that? Now, since we have it on the inside, we don't really need a legend. So I'm going to make the legend go away, which is going to just make my chart bigger. So I'm going to make this a bit bigger. So you can see our next steps. Okay, double click the chart title. This is region to sales in, I'm sorry, region to sales contributions. It'd help if that spelled great in January. I'm going to X out of that, and voila, our chart is done. It's very self-explanatory. You can obviously see that Ian um, was the um, heaviest contributor at 33% close behind, which Jake, and then it follows in with Fran, followed by Herb, and then Gabe. So this is your pie chart. Save this and submit it to um, Course Sites. Have an awesome day.